Hello, everybody. Today I'm going to show you a few stuff. So first, I need to get to my base. Mm. Oops. Forgot about negatives and positives. Got there. So here we have two signs and one hopper. The hopper leads to wait. Effect Act P sixteen. Um got it. Okay, I gave myself night vision. So the hopper gets the items down here, goes into a dispense dropper, dropper, um, will be the next. This the um when the new thing comes into the hopper, it'll activate. When the rest of comparator will sense it in there, it will give one sig um power to redstone repeater, which will give more power, and it will repeat itself. There's also um. A pressure plate that teleports the items to my base. That because you'll see why. So I want see it teleports in there. The only bad thing is that <coughs> it sometimes doesn't work. Let me go back up. Oops, I made bread. Bread. I don't know why I need bread. I might need it for later. Okay, now to get to my base, you click. Ooh, that's a problem. Ah, well, I was just thinking I could get my stuff. But, um, my minecart. Neat. So here, we have this dark room. This is, there's this zombie spawner that's not working right now. And there's a command block nearby, oh, over here. Wait, there. there's a command block over there that um, keeps making me survival. Now you can see a button here, you click it, and I see the doorway appears. Oh yeah, you're set to survival. Here, you might notice that you're not set to survival anymore. That's because it does, um, the command is slash, the um, command block Sets anyone to survival if um, they're in a 20 block radius. There. Now you click that sign. So this is my house. I mean, where my lab. My house actually is over there. Those are my balloon sheep. Their leads keep disappearing. Oh, that's new. So this is my house. Really small. Why bother? Random stuff goes in there. I also can't get my items back except for that sword I put in my to this dropper. Remember? It should teleport there. Over here. Oh, I guess it's not working. Ah well. Now that sword is actually a Sean sword. It has um breaking level two hundred uh, two twenty two thousand two hundred twenty two sharpness twenty two thousand two hundred twenty two and fire aspect. 20, um, to the 22,222. So this is a one shot kill. This also is the OP bow that I made with all the max enchantments. I need my arrow. I'm going to test this out. Test this out on an Ender Dragon. We also have a night vision. This also this one just gives you night vision. This one gives you command block, and this one gives you stone button. Now I'm going to see something new. My command block and my stone button. And my sign. So this one is supposed to do slash particle. But that's just the beginning. And for some reason zombies don't spawn. Here we have a sheep that shows how redstone can spread through redstone lamps. Well this one's going to be cool. First I when you fire a snowball, blocks will be placed along it. So that's how that's why there's so many floating blocks in this room. And then oh yeah. Now I was planning oh yeah, my test trader. This one trades a stone sword in the command block for a stone button. 
I don't know why he made it for his stone button. See? It was just for testing. Making custom villages. Okay, let's get those stuff back. Sean Sword. Command block. Button. So, this is what I was planning to make. So, you have two command blocks next to each other. So, the sheep is showing that the power, um, the the power source is the pressure plate. It can spread to the blocks touching it. So if I put a button here, it will spread here and here and the block below, block be up, above it, the block behind it, the command block. <clears throat> I'm going to do slash effect. Oh, actually, this might help. Game mode zero IP. You'll see something wrong. Okay, cool. Oh, now here we do effect at P21. No, 10,000. Here we do such effect 22. Wait, at P22. What? 10,000. Two, five, five. Okay, let's see if this works. Yeah. So you can see that the health bar is weird. Hmm? That's because it uses absorption and extra health level two hundred fifty five, and it fills up your screen. Mode. What? That doesn't set you to creative mode? Never knew that. Okay, I need to get creative mode. Okay. I can't see. My friends like it. Hmm. Oh, yeah. Oh, I forgot. I need to be in open creative mode. First game mode when at P. There. On my one card unit. I just do slash kill at E type mine cart test. Apparently there's no more. Oops. Uh oh. So let's say I have my mine cart chest here. I'm gonna name it Minecart Loot. So I'm gonna place it. Okay. And I put these two things in there. If I do slash kill at E type minecart chest, that thing would die. Then I have these two items here. Then I do slash TP at E type item. IP, which is me, will teleport every single dropped item in the world to me. Now let's try out my two OP and stuff. So, I'm going to summon an Ender Dragon and see if I can kill it. I just hit it with my sword. Kill an everyone. Get a lot of experience and three end. And this is the end zoom. First, ooh, that's cool. Honestly, the physics of water on top of a portal. I'm going to use that portal. <laughs> now for the bow. I'm going to summon the ender dragon. Let it fly around. Shoot it. Did I kill it? Hmm. Let's see if it still exists. Oh wait, it's so I'm horrible at archery. Got it. I killed it.
Yeah, I killed it again. Okay, so let's see. A new experiment. This liquid effect bottles. Hmm. I wonder. Jump. I like the end music. It's not funny. So, oh yeah, I remember. So there was this person who asked me if he could be in my video. So I'm going to make a very lame video about him. Okay, there. That's the end. Also, I don't have my spawn point. So if I kill myself in the end, I respawn back in the end. Hmm. I'm not dying. I killed myself. So yeah, I'm going to have to stay here forever. Nope. This is a server as a plugin. Spawn works. Slaggy. Oh, this one uses the slash title command. And this one uses the particle command. There's also subtitles, but something went wrong. Probably slash clone. Slash clone is a cool command. So let's go and test it out here. This in this broken place where I can summon Hmm. Ah, nothing. So if ooh, I got an even better idea. Yay, now I set this thing on fire. So anyways, as this entire thing starts getting on fire. Um what was I thinking? I don't know. Oh yeah, slash clone. So slash clone. You do slash clone. And then you get the um first position that I wanted to be. Um I just wanted to use relative position. Here, here, here. And the second position. This should be 1,000 blocks. Then the location where you want to put the clone place. Mm. Hmm. Oh yeah, they're overlapping. Does that work? Should be underground. Oh. Oh, found it. So that's negative. Wow. <laughs> that's gonna be funny. I'm gonna start cloning more stuff. Does this work? Let's see. Where did you go? Oh, look, it's a horse. Um, let's see, what else do I have? I don't know. No cool tricks. Maybe I could build something. Yeah, I'm going to build something. Oh yeah, Cave Spider. No. Oh. Oh yeah, this. that's the end of the video.